What's up, Shady Dust over here, and this is not a dumpster dive video. This is just a little blog I wanted to make. Um, recently got the tax check back in, and uh, I wanted to spend a little bit of money on a couple things I wanted, and something from my childhood that I can remember, video, um, TV shows watching and stuff like that. And um, so I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I grew up with, and I got it back, I got them on DVDs, and um, just a little blog, just to let you know, hey, this is the kind of stuff I enjoy watching, and some of the stuff you may not never heard of, but these are some of the good, good TV shows and good fun stuff that even kids nowadays can even watch. And as adults, we can watch and have fun with. Um, my dad loved this show when he was growing up. Martin Rowan's Laughing, the complete series. Um, if y'all know who John Wayne is, the actor, um, he actually there's one episode where he's actually in a bunny suit. I've always wanted to see that episode, and I've never seen it. I've watched it. it used to be on TV Land a lot, and uh, so, but I never seen the episode. So, I actually bought the complete collection because I enjoyed that show with my dad. So, and the next up we got here is MacGyver, and uh, well, let me actually open this up. Yeah, there is seven seasons. There's like 38 discs in this box. So, and it's even got some bonus features. But uh, I thought that was really cool. And next up we got MacGyver, which I gotta remember how to open this. And it comes in a complete series. I like this. It kind of reminds me of the old floppy disk. So, all seven seasons of it. And uh, I always loved MacGyver. I've been watching his clips on YouTube. So, now I get to finally watch every episode. And the next up here is, is the Beauty and the Beast TV show. Uh, I remember watching a few episodes of it back in the day. And I thought it was pretty cool. Kind of a love story. I can't remember much about it, so I figured something and the wife can watch. And then, of course, like I said, I'm a John Wayne fan. And let me turn this off. Just wore some laundry, so uh, this has got seven of his movies, including McClintock. This is on Blu-ray. And uh, we got if this will focus in here, documentary, The Dawn Riders, uh, Texas Terror, The Trail Beyond McClintock. Uh, <coughs> The Star Packer and the Hurricane Express. Most of these are like his older, older movies when he was very, very young. And this is one movie I'm going to watch tomorrow, which I love this movie, The Longest Day. And this has got some really good actors in it. And, uh, and of course, it's just a collection of his movies. Um, there's some of the movies that are on there, which is really good. And uh, this is from the 90s. It was only a short, I think, one season, maybe two. Thunder in Paradise with Hulk Hogan in it. It was really cool. And growing up on Saturday mornings, they would play these cartoons. And uh, this was Dick Dashley and Muttley the Flying Machine and their Flying Machines Complete Series. Uh, this was actually really good. Kids would love this. It's actually really funny. Um, it's set back in like a World War II setting, which is really cool. And um, this is another one they show on Saturday morning cartoons. Thunder the Barbarian, the complete series. Pretty much all the Hanna Barbera series I'm going to try to get on DVD or Blu ray. I enjoy this is set up after apocalyptic um, Earth, thousands of years in the future. So I enjoyed that series and I get to finally see the whole thing. And next up is I got the season three and four coming. Uh, me and my wife both enjoyed this. Um, I only watched a little bit of it, but it's the dinosaurs, and, uh, the one thing I remember is about that baby right there. Not the mama, not the mama. Beating his dad over the head with a, uh, pain every time. And this is Woody Woodpecker, not like the movie, new movie. This is the original cartoon series, and, uh, this was really cool. Let me see if I can open this up here. Some of these I haven't actually opened up. I just got them in a day, so... Come on. This is actually like like holes in it. And it's, it is like really, really cool. So let me pop it out here. And uh, of course on the back. Shows that gentleman right there who uh, actually is the creator of Woody Woodpecker. And uh, it's on the art side. It's only three disc. Which is really cool. And there is several amount. Playing from 
was like 1955. So these are like original cartoons. These are oldies, and but really good. And this says Guess Who on it. These are stuff I grew up on Saturday morning cartoons watching. I enjoyed watching, and uh, some of the. Uh, let me see if I can get that in there real quick. Some of these cartoons nowadays, they're they're okay, but they don't have the laughter, the the seriousness that that these like these two cartoons have. This is hilariously funny. It'll make you laugh all the way through. And that one, which is really cool, it's got action. It's got the whole nine yards. So this is like one of those I really enjoyed a lot watching. He's got his sun sword, and uh, it's 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 really hard to explain, but it's something you guys would definitely love to watch if you enjoy my Duffer's Eye videos. And this one lets you guys get to know me a little bit and what I what I like to watch. And there's some other series I'm going to get to later on, but I want to show you some of this stuff. Like to me. It's not politically correct. Uh, for some of you younger viewers, if you watch some of this, you probably go, "Oh, that's horrible." You're going, you, you'll get offended by some of it. But hey, it's hilarious. It's comedy. And it's got some really great actors in it, and uh, and that's why I really enjoyed watching that series. Just because there's some slapstick humor in it, it's it's really good. And uh, so this is just a little video. I just wanted to let you guys know. Hey, look, this is what some of the stuff I grew up with watching. Um, teenage years to my childhood on because my dad was a big John Wayne fan and which I became a big John Wayne fan this series my dad really didn't care for of course back then we couldn't record shows and uh, of course we only had like four or five channels too I think this was on like early 90s I can't remember and then of course MacGyver same way you really if you had a VCR you was playing video tapes you really didn't record too much and this was from like the 60s and, and stuff like that as you can tell from the box but that is pretty cool. 60, early, late 60s, early 70s. And uh, and yes, that is Goldie Hawn right there on the front. That is a young Goldie Hawn. So, there's a lot of good actors in it. So I thought I'd just make this little video. Let you guys know, hey, this is what I watch. This is what I enjoy doing. Um, so, <clears throat> and I went to GameStop this morning. And, uh, of course, after buying the PS4, I actually had and I bought a huge amount of games for that little challenge. Well, I had a $10 off there, so <laughs> I actually used it, and I actually bought a couple of games this morning. Oh, excuse me. And, uh, so I bought me the, turn this around here, Call of Duty. I've been wanting to play this. I hadn't played it yet, so. And then I also bought this one. Of course, I bought them, as you can tell, pre-owned. So, try to build my points up, because my actual uh, status is getting ready to be up to i think tomorrow so i gotta go in like this time next week and there's my dog roscoe hey roscoe hi roscoe so i want to get some more points built up for that so like i said these are the stuff i watched growing up i hope you guys like it hey leave a comment below what was your favorite show growing up i would like to know i really would i mean honestly i would love to know what shows you guys watched growing up and no also tell me how, some of my viewers what age you guys are um so this is kind of my spending for the year on uh, DVDs and stuff. Um, kind of went a little overboard, but like I said, this is stuff that me and my wife both can watch. And, uh, and like with that one, we, we the cartoon ones we can watch with, with our little boy. And uh, and uh, so thank you guys once again. And this is the Shade Trimps over here. And I guess it's just a blog of, of shows I liked. And um, as I get more, I will definitely gotta show you guys. And I recently got all my consoles back inside that was in my shed. So it's going to be about a week or two. Then I'm going to start testing. Once I get my, t the, there's a TV I've got back in the, the stand back here in my storage room right now. I'm going to get that in here in the next two weeks. So as soon as I get that in there, in there I'll be starting to test video games. And I will start making videos with it. Uh, if you guys know any editing programs that I could use to edit videos and stuff, so if you want to start game testing, let me know in the comments below. I would appreciate it. And if you know anybody who likes these videos, Dumpster Dive videos, or even some of the videos I'm making. Um, oh, by the way, I've enjoyed playing Kingdom Hearts, the new one. I haven't played much of it because I haven't had really much time. So I've enjoyed really playing it. Love my camo controller. So, um, but I will say this. The PS4, because this is original. It's not the, the Pro or nothing like that. the original Xbox. I watched the WWE Network's uh, last pay-per-view uh, fast lane, and it was better on that than that. So, this is Shay Trip Star. Say good luck, good finds, and I hope you all enjoyed my blog.